The Ghana Broadcasting Corporation, GBC, says the company has been treated unjustly and unfairly by the Ghana Football Association in the bidding process that led to Star Times winning the television broadcast rights of the Ghana Premier League and the FA Cup. According to the national broadcaster, the bid they presented was financially superior to that of Star Times and have questioned why the GFA still went ahead to announce the Chinese company as winners. On Wednesday, January 8, 2020, the GFA announced Star Times had won the rights to broadcast the Ghana Premier League and the FA Cup in a five-year deal worth $5.25 million. The figure works out to $1,050,000 US dollars annually. This amount, GBC claims, is lower than their offer of $1,100,000 US dollars. Parts of the statement signed by the company's head of corporate affairs, Ms. Mamle Asari, said the GFA's decision will gravely impact on Ghanaians' access to the Premier League and the FA Cup live games on free-to-air broadcasts. GBC ultimately wants the bidding process reviewed. Both technically and actually, the GBC offer was superior. That is not in doubt. Te- technically, we know that GBC has a free to air capability, Satan does not have that. We also know very well that we have a network of FM stations, Satan does not have that. We also are ready, and in our bid with this state, that we are going to collaborate with local Ghanaian broadcasters, as we have always done in the past. We have the record. So why tell us that we, we are not there? When you call for bid, and the financially and technically superior bid doesn't win, of course, the speaker must complain. And that is our story. We are not bad losers. We, we just think that public opinion should build on GFA too provide an opportunity for us to appeal. Public opinion should build against GFA to let them review their decision or to come public and show us to full disclosure because even though it is a professional association, of course, it, it, it should demonstrate fairness to Ghanaians that Ghanaians deserve a fair GFA.